Good morning, Economicon. I'm Scott R. Jones of uh, Keeping It Brilliant Ministries, coming to you from Threshold 616 on the West Coast, best coast of this fine, dark, old continent. Uh, what we'd like to do at Threshold 616, and we did this last year, uh, the last time at Necronomicon, is of course we do a little bit of an uh, incantation in which, obviously not all of us have brought our copies of the Necronomicon, myself included, and that's kept in the secret vault. Uh, but we can lift our astral copies in the air, so I'll ask you to do that with me, brothers and sisters, lift our astral copies in the air, in the, in the air and say, after me, this is my Necronomicon. <laughs> says I am. I can do what it says I can do. And I will be what it says I will be. I will be what it says I will be. I am witness to its wonder and glory in my life. I am witness to its wonder and glory in my life. By Dagon's teeth and the black gnosis I seek. By Dagon's teeth and the black gnosis I seek. Thank you. Uh, that was wonderful. Thank you. I will let the 17 members of Threshold 616 know how well you did today. You know, I'm very glad that Brother Goodfellow here uh, has uh, touched on the subject of doubt because I find it to be a very uh, contagious, uh, viral uh, thing in our species, and it certainly is something that's affected us uh, in Victoria. Uh, we recently uh, had one of our one of our brothers, uh, Todd. Uh, Todd uh, had uh, you know completed a number of our degrees, uh, which I won't go into here. But he had put in a lot of work, and we were uh, preparing him uh, for uh, a small rite that we call uh, the long dive. Uh, oh no! And as the concrete was setting around his feet. <laughs> Todd expressed to me uh, that he was experiencing some doubt at this juncture. Uh, of course, I think, you know, he, he basically self-selected himself, and we were very happy to be assisting him with his long dive, but I think some of the detura we got was off. My supplier, I'll need to speak to him. Right, you know, excellent. All right, we'll talk after the service. Uh, so I spoke with him and tried to allay some of his doubts. Um, but then I found that, you know, I was having my own doubts. I was having doubts about my father. He doesn't have that. My relationship with my dad. You know, I was having doubts about uh, my imposter syndrome. You know, I'm also a writer, as pretty much most people here are. Uh, I was having doubts about, you know, how my uh, debut collection coming out from Trepidatio Publishing uh, the first week of December Doubt, though, is the royal road to potential. 
Doubt opens our mind and our hearts to what could be. It's not an obstacle. It can be seen as a key to the realm where things were, are, and will be. Or, as we also know it, the realm of the great old ones where they walk undimensioned and unseen, serene and primal. And it's that serenity I want to leave you with today, brothers and sisters. We need to allow doubt to not be a hindrance, but to be a guide. We need to enter into doubt fully so that we press through to the other side of it. I'm not talking about faith. Faith is, according to another uh, somewhat holy book, the uh, a short expectation of things heard, but unseen. And you're hearing all of us today, but it is literally all hearsay. You need to push through the doubt, push through even the idea of faith, you know, and get to the realities that are behind. It is not faith. It is, however, keeping it real, yeah, as we like to say. <laughs> Where in keeping it real, yeah, we take personal responsibility for placing stone upon stone upon stone in our hearts so that we may raise real, yeah, here and here. And this is how we affect the world. This is how it has always been done. So, as for Todd, he... <laughs> Todd took his long dive, finally, over the side of the boat. <laughs> and there was a brief moment of screaming before the waters closed over his head, but I like to think that he got his reward. <laughs> Brothers and sisters, thank you today. Raise your Necronomicons again. This is my Necronomicon. This is my Necronomicon. I am what it says I am. I am what it says I am. I can do what it says I can do. I can do what it says I can do. I will be what it says I will be. I will be what it says I will be. I am witness to its wonder and glory in my life. I am witness to its wonder and glory. Teeth, by the black noses I seek. Thank you very much. Keep on keeping it really in.